can not talk with gum in my mouth. Throughout this video, I want to give some advice to people wanting to start a YouTube channel. If you're wanting to start a YouTube channel and just start documenting more, um, the foundation that it should come from is your authentic self and what you are passionate about. So it, there should be no toxic reasonings for why you want to start a YouTube channel. Like for example, you want to be famous or you want to get back at someone or like prove yourself to someone. Be as authentic as possible. Obviously, it, it's weird in front of a camera. Like, trust me, it's taken me a long time to get used to um, just holding up a camera like this. It's weird. For lunch, I'm having chana masala over rice with avocado on top with some chili powder and pepper um, seasonings. The more you upload, the more you will feel comfortable with doing this. It's like a muscle. You work it out and it gets big. If you're wanting to start a YouTube channel, you must understand that the technical side of things, um, the editing, the software, the cameras, it can be a lot. It can be a lot. Not just like, I'm not talking about like prices. Like you can record on your phone. Who gives a shit? Actually, the, the quality does matter. But anyways. <laughs> so when I first started making vlogs back in my hometown, um, I remember literally spending like two days straight just trying to upload it. I finally got my first vlog uploaded and I realized that it was muted because of the music I used. Um, I thought the music would be fine, but it wasn't. I didn't realize how strict YouTube is with the copyright uh, on music. I guess starting out vlogging, it's definitely a trial and error. It's just a matter of learning the ropes and finding a way to upload these videos in a timely manner. When you're first figuring that out, it can be very, like, oh my god, overwhelming. But as of now, um, and I'm very happy with what I'm editing in. Um, I'm using Adobe Premiere to edit. I have all of Creative Cloud, so I create my thumbnails using Photoshop, I edit my photos in Lightroom, and I do some stuff on Adobe Illustrator, and I'm so, so happy that I got the Creative Cloud. Shout out Colby, like, thank you. You have to figure out what works for you. Okay. I just got to the airport, we're picking up my mom. Yes, we as in Kane and I. Ah, cane. Sorry, pup. Mom gets shotgun. Oh, God. Oh, cane. Oh. <laughs> I told him mom gets shotgun. <laughs> Mom's here. So, mom got me this really cute shirt when she was shopping today. Was that today? That was today, right before we came. And it was only $4 or $4. something like that. $4. I'm gonna put it on right now. <laughs> it's adorable. It's a billabong. Oh, cute. We sale or thrift. Or thrift. That's the way to do it. <laughs> so I was telling my mom that for Pride on Saturday, I want another bucket hat because I've just been wearing this bucket hat every day since I came back from Beijing. We were looking on like Amazon and other websites and like the cool fuzzy bucket hats that I was thinking of. They're like $50. So we got the idea to make our own. <laughs> we're gonna so, do it. But we only have 30 minutes at Joann's right now before they close. I'm gonna look at fabric. Mom is on a mission to the patterns. <laughs> Yep, this is the one. This is the one. Yep. <laughs> Another thing to keep in mind if you're wanting to start a YouTube channel, make sure you monetize your channel as soon as you can. As soon as you can. With my dreadlock video, I didn't start getting money from it until it hit like a million views, uh, which is like $6,000-ish. So make sure you monetize your channel like as soon as you can. Yeah. We ended up just getting one fabric, and we're just gonna see how it goes. Hey you guys, so we are at Earth Cafe.
Okay, our first night together. It is. Ooh. Take my money, friends. Mushroom coffee to start my day. Okay. <laughs> You're still asleep. <laughs> Hey you guys, so uh, it's the next day. I don't remember if I told you if it's the next day or not, but it's the next day. Um, we wanted to do the hat last night, like we were super excited, but it just got too late. So now it is the next day and we are um, putting out the pattern to the hat. I don't think I showed you the pattern. We got, we found this little pattern and we are doing this design here. You know what, let's go to Walmart. Lucky for you guys, I'm still giving advice on how to start a YouTube channel or, you know, that type of deal. The biggest setback that I see when people are first starting a YouTube channel or first starting to document their lives in that way, they're timid when they're about to record and like just they're afraid to hold up their camera and everything like that, which I totally get, it's weird like I said. But just know, just know that people who watch YouTube and the viewers, like, they want to see what you're doing. They are interested, point blank period. They are interested in your life. So just do you and it'll be fine. Okay, we are back home from Walmart and we are pinning the um, patterns, <laughs> patterns. So I'm not sure what I'm doing, but mom is handing me things to sew and I'm sewing it. With right sides together, stitch half crown to half top. <laughs> oh no, mom. Hey, Will. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh fuck, it's small. It's custom. It's all it's custom. custom. This is a custom fit. You cannot get this fit anywhere else. It won't fit on anyone else's head. It's just from my head. Sorry. <laughs> That's funny. Where's Vinny? He went to Miggy's. Okay, well, we are finally done with the hat. It took a good uh, five hours. Um, I really suggest you to not try this. I mean, try it, but like, just so you know, it's hard. So I take my hat off to hat makers because that shit was complicated. With that being said, it looks, um, it looks nice, you know? It really does look nice. To end off this entire video and the advice that I've been giving to you guys, if I'm able to help one person, um, inspire one person, help one person, then I am so grateful. So if you gained anything from this video, I'm grateful and I'm so happy that you were able to take something away from this. <laughs> That's all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sending you so much love and light and I'll see you guys in the next video.